Tonight, the Empire Film and Media Ensemble, a student group at the Eastman School of Music, is presenting the 1989 classic film Batman, screened at Kodak Hall at Eastman Theater, live to picture with a symphony orchestra. And naturally, our music man and comic fan, Dan Gross, went behind the curtain to learn about this ensemble, the score, and the performance. Empire is just a really unique thing that most cities don't have. Being part of Empire allows me to be in that creative process and be able to express my creativity not only through music but also through administrative roles. So it's kind of wherever I need it. Um, by the time we get in the rehearsal room, uh, my job is more or less to just be an extra set of ears because um, my work is pretty much all beforehand getting everything ready to go. I got an email in my inbox one day with, uh, uh, you know, the box office here and the concert office going, hey, we, we got the rights to Batman. Are you guys interested in doing it? And I think my response was, yes, absolutely, when? <laughs> I love this movie when it came out in 1989. I love the score. I'm a big fan of Danny Elfman. He has such a unique style. And his collaborations with director Tim Burton are legendary. They both hit it out of the park. He, he did not think like an orchestral composer. And, and so I, I really want the students to play with a certain abandon. As a low brass player, we only come in really at the big moments and like the large booms. So being able to put all of our effort into those moments uh, really helped the music come alive. Being able to play Batman is a super exciting endeavor. If I want people to come to my concerts, I'm going to put in as much effort as I can. The fact that we have people coming in from the community means a lot to us. That looks like a lot of fun. Dan, thank you. The show tonight, 730 again at Kodak Hall at Eastman Theater. We have ticket information over at Rochester First dot com.